Dear colleagues, this is how I inject anti VEGF, either Bibhasis Jumav or Renibizumav in the vitreous cavity. The eye is being draped now. The eyelashes have been kept away from the eyeball and now the plastic drape is cut just a little below the center the idea is to cover the upper eyelid very nicely it is better to use uncut plastic drips so that we can cut it at the appropriate size now a few drops of anesthetic agents have been applied this is paracaine two paracaine eye drops this will anesthetize the ocular surface and now this is where speculum to keep the eye open and that's it now a thorough wash of the ocular surface is given using betadine 5 percent lotion this is betadine 5 percent lotion betadine is povidone iodine that is polyvinyl pyrolidone iodine povidone iodine is applied has been applied in the preparation room and this is the second time it is being applied on the operation table after a thorough wash of the ocular surface in India we inject anti vsf in the operation theaters we don't this is the, this is Renibi Jumav from Intas pharmaceuticals it is marketed as Rajumab uh, Renibi Jumav this is point on emerald in a tuberculin syringe and now I'm going to inject it first the measurement I'm going to use this is moxifloxacin I'm at about 3.5 millimeter away from the limbus. I'm going to mark a spot. To protect the corneal epithelium, I have asked for HPMC, that is hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose. Uh, I'm going to coat the corneal epithelium with SPMC and before that I just wash the epithelium nicely and this is how you can coat the epithelium to protect it and now this is uh, marking as point which is about three point five millimeter away from the limbus and now before injecting the at a certain point the conjunctiva is retracted like this it goes almost tangentially for some distance obliquely and then it turns inward just like a 23 gauge stroker is introduced into the vitreous cavity in the same fashion the 30 gauge needle goes into the vitreous cavity and after I am sure after I can see the needle I ask my assistant to inject it and then I do a small stab incision and express out some aqueous humor a little paracentesis so that the optic nerve is not damaged now I pull the needle out 
and t's the area that's it this is how anti-VEGF injection can be given hope this helps